water is crucial to our daily lives. We drink water, we cook with water, we wash with water. Water is a food product. In fact, it's the largest food industry. It's also used as a food ingredient and to prepare the food we eat. Because it comes from our taps, we might not think of it this way. Water should be clean, clear and safe to drink. So it's vitally important that the same high standards of hygiene practice required in food production are maintained in the water production, distribution and supply processes. Water companies in the UK are responsible for protecting public health by producing and delivering clean, clear and safe drinking water. These water companies are regulated by the Drinking Water Inspectorate for England and Wales, the Drinking Water Inspectorate for Northern Ireland and the Drinking Water Quality Regulator for Scotland. They all have the power to fine companies and individual workers. Water can carry diseases, pathogens such as E. coli and parasites such as Cryptosporidium. Water can also become contaminated and drinking contaminated water can cause serious illness. You could contaminate the clean water supply when you're working on a treatment works, in the networks, on or around service reservoirs or on water towers. By following simple hygiene procedures like cleaning and disinfecting tools before use, you can help reduce this risk. If you enter clean water sites or work on the clean water network known as restricted operations, you must hold a National Water Hygiene Registration. The National Water Hygiene Scheme, also known as the Blue Card, has been developed in collaboration with all UK water companies and is mandated by them. The scheme helps to ensure the protection of public health and promote good water hygiene practices. The Chief Inspector of the Drinking Water Inspectorate, England and Wales, had this to say. A competent workforce is fundamental to the delivery of safe, clean drinking water. The National Water Hygiene Scheme provides knowledge and awareness to those working on clean water supply systems and enables water companies and contractors to demonstrate their commitment to a public health culture. Good hygiene practices work. Following them have been proven to prevent contamination, prevent the spread of disease and maintain the quality of drinking water. To find out more about the National Water Hygiene Scheme, go to the EUSR website, eusr.co.uk forward slash national water hygiene.